from days of long ago comes a legend. The legend of Voltron, defender of the universe. Five fearless lion robots. Black lion. Green lion. Yellow lion. Red lion. Blue lion. Yeah, yeah, Robotron. Who together form Voltron. Lion sets each sold separately from Matchbox. Video 5200 the smash hit mr. mom with realistic sound effects and scenes straight from the movie for the Atari entertainment video home system it's, it's out, out of this, this world, world. here, Radio 1980. I'm going to show you some of my collection of 80s action figures there. Things I've been collecting over the years there. Some of my favorite uh, heroes of all time. Like, you know, you've got your, uh, your Mr. T there from the, uh, the A-Team there. With his, uh, you know, action-packed uh, physique and haircut. And, you know, he's got his machine gun there, and he's ready to take on the bad guys. You know, he's uh, doing infomercials these days. But, you know, hey, back in the day, Mr. T was the man there. You know, he could build a uh, you know, tank out of a, uh, I don't know, uh, Carino and some, you know, barbed wire. And take out, you know, local bad guys with, the, you know, his 18 buddies there. So Mr. T was uh, pretty cool there. And, you know, you got your classics there, like, you know, the little Superman with his karate punch action. Because, you know, Superman likes karate there. And, you know, he can uh, take out the, the Legion of Doom there with all the uh, evil baddies. And, you know, unless they've got, like, the kryptonite there. Superman's, you know, is a classic. So we also got here, you know, we got the trap jaw here, there, you know, from the Masters of the Universe. With, you know, they got that, that punch, swing punch action there, and he's got all kinds of weapons and stuff there. Hey, Lord, you find the trap jaw there with the mouth of trap jaw. So he's pretty cool. Another one in the uh, Masters of the Universe I like there. The man he faces. You know, he's, he's got a full name, unlike most of them. You know, he's got a uh, robot suit on there. You know, his face can change from like a monster there to, uh, you know, robot face. You know, for when he wants to do his math homework. And, you know, after, after that he wants to cut loose. You know, he's got the uh, Ziggy Stardust face there. So, you know, he's pretty cool. You know, in the uh, Masters of the Universe there, they had uh, all the baddies. But they only had, like, the one lady figure there. I think her name is Teela there. And she was the only girly figure. The action figure for her is kind of weird, you know. These guys are pretty big, but she's got bigger thighs than he does. I mean, look at that. 
She's been uh, doing on the thigh mask a little too much, if you ask me there. You know, and then later on in the 80s, they came out with the, what's the She-Ra there. I think this is one of her friends or something. You know, she's kind of the girly action figure there for the for the girls to play with, you know, and brush the hair and whatnot. But, you know, the girly figure there, you know, she looks a little better than, uh, you know, Thunder Thighs Teela. I don't know, uh, maybe that's a special edition they got going there. And this guy here, he's from the, uh, I think the, uh, the Shiva there, and he was like the only guy. So, you know, he and her, uh, you know, they, they, uh, are the only ones in their line there, but he, he looked a little, uh, made up, if you know what I'm, you know what I'm saying there. He's got a little too much, uh, eyeliner on there, I think, to appeal to the girls for some reason, because, you know, girls like guys with eyeliner for some reason. And, you know, you got, you got the, the head tails guy from, uh, I don't know, what's the Space 1999 there? He was the big, uh, the big worm guy's henchman. He was pretty cool. You know, I'll take you to that guy now, you know. He's easily duped. Oh, yeah. Another of my favorites there from the 80s there. You know, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. This one's like Private Dick Donatello or something. You know, he's working on the side. Because, you know, being a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle doesn't pay all that much. And, you know, he's got a knife there. And he's got some battle action. I think, you know, he's got a uh, case file. And he's going to stake out, the, you know, the, uh, the no-tell motel, if you know what I'm saying. They got you down tell over there, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. This one, uh, here is, he's just, he's just come back from surfing. And he's got all kinds of sea life on him. You know, he, does, he needs to take a shower. Apparently, you know, he's got these uh, little uh, sharks for nunchucks. I don't quite get that, but, you know, that's pretty cool. 80s nostalgia there. And, uh, let's see. Oh, yeah. I'll be back there, you know. Terminator there. Which is, uh, you know, robot action. A little, you know, the old, uh, Cyborg guy here that chases everybody. He's pretty cool. I picked that up at a yard sale for like a penny. And you know we got the uh, Harry and the Andersons here. You know, I'm a Yeti. Whatever that movie was about there. And then uh, you know, John Lithgow. I, I had the John Lithgow figure there for a while. But you know I had to sell that on eBay because it was worth so much. And let's see what else we got here. Oh yeah, I got another you know, rare one here. Mexican He-Man. You know, with the wrestling mask there. He's a collector's item. There were a lot of knockoffs of the He-Man figures. This is my favorite one here because, you know, Mexican wrestling boy there. And let's see what else we got here. Uh, oh, one of my favorite action figures of all time. You know, the little Harry Hamlin action figure there from the uh, Clash of the Titans there. This one was real popular with the ladies, too. You know, like, oh, Harry Hamlin there. Oh, you're, you're so sexy. Uh, hello, thank you. Have you seen my hair? So, you know, that, that's, how, uh, that's how Harry Hamlin rolls there. I'll, uh, I'll let him sit there for a little bit. And let's see what else we got here. Oh, yeah. Uh, Danielson. Hi. Karate action, you know, Mr. Miyagi there from the Karate Kid. You know, and the action figure's got a little crossbow here, you know. When he doesn't have time for the karate, he's going to gonna shoot him with the crossbow. But he's got kick action there. And uh, Mr. Miyagi doesn't take, uh, take no guff from nobody, you know, where it's crossbow time. What else we got here? Oh, yeah. Big Gun Rambo. And he's got a big old knife there. And, uh, you know, he's uh, pretty uh, screen accurate there to, uh, to Stallone. That's pretty cool, you know. His face is a little pale. I don't know. Maybe he's, he's killed one too many Viet Cong and he's, you know, getting kind of nauseous. 
But uh, he, they just got pretty cool accessories there for him. Let's see what else we got here. Oh yeah, you know, some of these rare action, you know, knockout figures that didn't uh, take off too well. This here is uh, Karate Christopher Cross. He was uh, kind of an unknown little uh, animated series there in the 80s. He didn't take off very well. But uh, one that did. You got, uh, you know, big man Chuck Norris here with his karate action. Let's see if I can get him going here. Bad Lex karate chapin. Oh, yeah. Look at that. He can kick your ass right there. Chuck Norris with a bad lights. I mean, you're pretty much dead. You had him a little animated series there in the 80s. It was pretty cool. I bought the DVD set there. And, you know, another classic from the 80s, you know, the 80, 1980 movie there, Popeye. He's one of my favorites there. This is a bazooka action Popeye there. He's had enough. He's going after Bluto, you know, with the bazooka. Bazooka! So, you know, he could kick some ass. And let's see. That's about all I got there. Let me ask you guys a question here on, on the uh, World Wide Web there. If you had to choose, let's do a little shirt skins here. We got uh, Mr. T with a machine gun and Mr. Miyagi there with a crossbow up against Rambo there and uh, Chuck Norris for the Bad Lex. Who do you think would win? I know who I've got my money on, but, you know, hey, put some uh, suggestions down in the box and, uh, I don't know, maybe you'll, you'll win some of this stuff as a prize or something. So, you know, hey, thanks for tuning in there. I'll have some more stuff, you know, coming up soon. I gotta go, uh, go uh, work out a little more. Mm, oh, yeah. Mm. I think I'm gonna snap into one of these, if you know what I'm saying. High score there. Get the high score there. Yes! High score! Hey! Where is everybody?